Right, this is a quick tutorial because I've been asked how we produce the uh, theme at VenturaCottage.com, particularly how we're able to achieve the teaser layout with one story on top and then two columns, and then how we do the right-hand line thumbnails. As a starting point, if we look at the first story, click on the Welcome, and then look at the coding by going to Edit. As this was a one-off story with a rectangular picture, the easiest way, uh, and it always stays the same, the easiest way was to, to do it with a piece of code. So all we did was uh, link to a JPEG, Ventura Cottage underscore SML, give it a width, a height, and align it right, and that achieves the first story. Now if we look at how we do the two columns, first thing you need to do is go to drupal.org and download bonus pack, uh, sorry, views bonus, which as the name suggests is an additional model that enhances the views module. Particularly what we're interested in is a view called panels, teasers, one plus two columns. So if we go back to Ventura Cottage, download an installed views bonus and then look at administer views, we will see that there is a new view automatically called front page. If we go to edit, scroll down and then look at view type. There are various ones to choose from but we're interested in the one called panels, teasers, one top plus two columns. Down to the bottom and save and then we need to go to site information in the administer section. So we scroll down for that. In site information we go down to the bottom and where you'd normally have front page, default front page node, we just alter that to be the view that we've been talking about called front page. Once we do that, the front page will now have one on top plus the two columns, but we still have to deal with the, um, the thumbnails and the right hand align. For the thumbnails I always use image cache so that's a matter of downloading and installing CCK image and image cache and then producing a preset called thumbnail. This has two parts the first thing is scale it to 100 by 100 and those are outside dimensions and the second part crops it to 100 by 100 and centers uh, from the center of the picture. That means that irrespective of whether the picture was portrait or landscape you will end up with a 100 by 100 square thumbnail on the um, teasers on your home page. Now in order to achieve the right hand align because by default it'll be left align and it won't be within the text it'll be above the text we need to alter the style sheet. So all you do is go into style CSS and produce one small new section which basically tells it if the field type is image float it right, put some space around it and um, the final thing that I tend to do is put in an extra line, border, naught pixels, solid red or whatever. What that means is while you're testing it you can alter the pixels to two or three pixels, perhaps change the color and find out whether it is actually using the coding and um, work out what's happening from there. So having done that you will end up with a home page that looks like VenturaCottage.com I hope this short tutorial has been of help to people. If you'd like more information, there's a tutorial section at VenturaCottage.com and I can be contacted via the website as well. Thank you for listening.